All right, this is a tune practice video for a tune called Willith Yord. It is a Shetland C chanty and it is in the key of D. The thing that's important about this tune is its rhythm pattern. And it has a syncopation that uh, is repeated throughout the piece. So the rhythm uh, pattern goes like this. So that is uh, the recurring rhythm pattern. Now I'm going to play the tune for you. And I am left-handed, so um, really don't pay attention to the, the hammering pattern as much to just listen to the tune. to show you the right-handed pattern which in the A part where you're going to be primarily playing on the right side of the treble bridge. Your pickup note should be with your left hand so that your right hand accents the first beat of each measure. So here you start on the B right below the C uh, marker and that's the first chord is basically a syncopated D arpeggio. The next is a G arpeggio. And back to the D. And then you start on the E and you travel up four notes and back down. Back to the D arpeggio. come over to the uh, left side of the treble bridge and uh, go up the scale from starting with the A. Let's do that one more time. The arpeggio. That's the A part. Now, the B part is played all on the left side of the treble bridge. And again, if you're right-handed, you will use your left hammer for the pickup note. Always try that again. same way as the A part, starting with the A down here and going up the scale. arpeggios but you're playing them in a syncopated way basically. Alright let's play it together um, slowly 
I will try to play it slowly. It's very hard for me to do that because it's such a jazzy number, but let's try it. Let's try it a little bit faster. And you'll have to excuse my little mistakes because I'm trying to play this right handed and I'm left handed. All right. Oops. One last time, and uh, this is the way, the tempo I like it. Key of D from the Shelton, Shel Shetland Islands.